FDA 21 CFR 11 in Sinon. Sinon consistently meets the criteria of the FDA 21 CFR part 11 throughout all its modules. The Sinon principle of setting parameters instead of programming, the high object orientation and the multi-project administration save up to 90% in validation costs for new projects. It stipulates that all electronic data must be correspond to particular and requirements in order to ensure comprehensive documentation of all processes that is secure from manipulation. A significant element in FDA 21 CFR Part 11 compatible projects is, therefore, the audit trail. The audit trail in the editor. Sinon logs all project changes in the editor without exception, for example, new creation changes, deletions, copy and XML import. The audit trail in the runtime I can show you now. The chronological event list acts as an FDA compliant audit trail. All relevant changes are logged here in a manner that cannot be manipulated and on a lasting basis. This covers target value requirements as well as recipes and changes to archive entries. The following is noted in the protocol. The cell logs documents which, which have changed, the old and the new value, date and time of change, the user, the computer on which the change was made and the signature for signed actions. In addition, a comment on each entry can be saved in this way. There is also an alarm list and in the alarm administration this acts as an audit trail for the alarms. Here too all information on alarm acknowledgement is locked in an FDA compliant manner. This guarantees complete traceability in, in Sinon runtime. Two features I want to introduce to you now as well are the history of change and the project versioning. The history of change serves for complete documentation of the phase of engineering. All changes to a project such as change, delete, create, etc. can be protocoled. Per default, the history of change turned off and must be activated in the editor. The history of change you find here in the editor and you have to activate it like this. And here you can see in the history of change what I did in the last minutes. Who did it, which module, which object and I can also have a versioning here which I can also set in my settings here in the general settings I can set versioning active and another cool thing is I already made two project backups and for comparing what I did I just mark them and say compare selected backups and I can again see like my changes in the history of changes what I did. And the version number here is an orientation and security for you using always the right version of your project. Another very important uh, topic is the user administration and signing because every part of Xenon's user administration has been created to meet all FDA 21 CFR Part 11 requirements. No unauthorized access is possible even when systems that are projected by username and password have a locked in user and the user leaves the workspace for a short period of time. Xenon ensures this with its signature concept. Each user must verify themselves before using the system, even if they are already locked onto the system. This signature procedure is saved in the cell. An editable signature text is also recorded so that the action carried out can be locked precisely. I can show you this in an example in the runtime. 
Here in the batch control, for example, if I want to create a new recipe, they ask me for a login. This is one of the examples. Xenon has integral controls to facilitate all functionality independently or as an integrated solution. With integral user administration local to Xenon or through Active Directory or AD LDS. Audit trail, alarms, recipe management, archiving and reporting. All activities relating to a GMP regulated environment can be accommodated. Once the process has been designed by simple configuration of the integral functions, the project becomes compliant to international GMP regulations such as FDA CFR 21 part 11. <laughs>